Hi everyone, in this video we're going to be taking a look at this Sony VAIO VGN NW26M. It is a nice little computer uh, and it was bought several years ago. Uh, there's a big long story to uh, how that, well, how its history is, um, <laughs> which is rather funny, but that's a story for a different time. Um, but now let's just take a look at the features and generally delve into the actual sort of computer itself and what's good about it and what's not so good about it. So, I hope you enjoy this video. Uh, let's get on with the tour. Now, um, <clears throat> pardon me, sorry. Now, so the main features that are on the keyboard and everything is, um, We've got a web button up top there, which opens the default web browser, which is up there. We've got a uh, mute button, which is there, a display off button, and obviously the primary power on button, as well as a dreaded Pentium sticker. Um, and, yeah, obviously a touchpad. Um, so, I mean, it's okay, and it did have a webcam, in case you're wondering what that weird sticker was up there. Um, I won't put that on there because obviously she didn't use the webcam and um, yeah, it's bad anyway. Um, so let's just take a look around the general unit itself and go into all the weird things about it. So the first thing I'm going to do is most probably close the lid and bring it around the side here. We can see we have got a, a headphone jack. So it's got more features than the new iPhones. Um, it has got a mic input, two USB ports, a optical drive which can read and write, uh, a weird thing that I don't know what it does. And if we bring it around to the other side, one moment, we have got a uh, oh gosh, charge port. I don't know why I had a mental lapse then. Um, a Ethernet port a VGA port and a USB port so it looks rather good um, yeah obviously at the top we've got a nice sort of streamline pattern to it the Sony logo there and the VAIO logo there uh, obviously and well that's just about it apart from an SD port there and Magic Gate port, uh, the wireless network connection port there, and the lights. Uh, so, well, that's basically all of the features. Let's just start the thing up and get it to work. So, if I plug back in the charger, now I've got to be quiet because people are working in the house. So Take a little while. Right, so now I was looking on the Sony Bio website and they say on, well, they explain on there how to do this. Now I thought, oh goodness, because Windows 10 doesn't allow you to roll back to 7 after a certain amount of time, and it's been over a year since it's been using Windows 10. Um, because of obviously that free upgrade offer they were doing a while back. So anyway, yeah, bit rubbish, but I found a way around it. In Sony computers, uh, you can press F10, which loads up the recovery partition from when they pre-installed the operating, well, when the manufacturer pre-installed the operating system. And it's quite simple, I mean, we just got to press, obviously, power on, and F10. There we are. I mean, this might take a little while. Then you need to press enter, where it says edit boot options. And maybe enter again. Come on.
Now this might happen where it freezes and everything, but it's just a simple case of cold freestyling it. Um, which is rather annoying, but can't really be helped because it's weird. Come on. Yes, yeah, it's going to need to restart, isn't it? Naturally all goes wrong. I already did a sort of rehearsal for this and naturally all goes wrong whenever I... Oh, here we go. Yeah, all goes wrong whenever I actually start recording for the actual video. So, yeah. But there's the Windows 7 boot screen and bear in mind it's got Windows 10 uh, on it at the moment. So this is the, thankfully, the recovery partition. Uh, Wait for it to launch the recovery tools. Oh, I believe. Oh yeah, restore drive C. Here we are. Um, and just. So you can see up here, it stores Drive C to original factory condition, um, which is good. So if I press start, skip, <laughs> understand, start. Please. Now there's a lot of stuff there needs to do because. Obviously, if people don't really know what they're doing, then they'll delete all their data. So now it's just formatting the drive again. If I zoom in, maybe it'll be a bit easier for you all to see. Now, I think this is a good thing because when I try to enter in the Windows product key on this on the uh, Windows 7 website that Microsoft had provided, it said this it can't do it because it's it was pre installed with the system. Uh, refer to the manufacturer for guidance. So I did. And this is what it came up with, uh, if you want to do a fresh, uh, obviously restore from boot, so, yeah. <sighs> now it's just gonna take its time. <laughs> oh no, hopefully this won't happen continuously. <sighs> oh well, better luck next time. Again, press F10. Ah, oh, there we go. <sighs> well, let's just hope this works properly. <sighs> just pause in, see what happens this time. Well, absolutely none of that's worked, so I have ended up installing Windows 10 on it. Um, this is in the hope that it will get all its drivers through, um, and hopefully I can get the recovery disk through that, because I'm feeling the recovery partition is partly corrupt because it just didn't work properly. Um, although I think the hard drive might be short because it's... Um, it came up with the, oh, it's something, a funnel error, I think it is. I um, can't remember the exact term now for some reason. But yeah, so I think the hard drive's on its way out on this one. Um, but, oh well, never mind. Um, it'll be alright, so <laughs> I guess I'll just have to get the drivers. Um, for it and hopefully I can find a way to revert back to Windows 7. Hmm. Right, so Windows 10 has finished installing on the computer and I did a check disk uh, command on it and 
it came up with several bad sectors, so not really that good. Um, basically, the hard drive is most probably going to fail quite soon, but I'm not really going to use it anyway. Uh, so I believe that rounds out for this video, really. Uh, I do hope you enjoyed it all, and till the next video, see you later.